Calling the signals will be number three, Giovanni Flores. The handoff and then breaking off the tackle. Off, off left end, number five. And Steven Torres. And he will rip off a 32-yard run. First play from scrimmage and the Bulldogs. Power left or student body left and it was given off to Steven Torres, uh, one of the, in fact, that's the longest gain of the, the early game. First play from scrimmage is huge, just put it that way, okay? And we'll compare it down the road. First to 10 in uh, Roosevelt Rough Ruff Rider territory now. Line of scrimmage will be the Roosevelt 45 yard line, I formation. Oh, another big hole, gaping hole for 31. Michael Aguilar, 20. 10, 5, touchdown! Oh my goodness, Garfield exploding here. 11 minutes and 13 seconds and we have a 45 yard touchdown run by Michael Flores. Check that Michael Aguilar, number 31, we're gonna get it right. He was a featured player. In the LA Times this past October 25th, Eric Sondheimer on High School Sports Aguilar fulfills personal vision. And uh, there he is showing his skills. Michael Aguilar blind and legally blind in one eye. Bulldogs go for two, handoff straight up on the dive is Aguilar. And it's eight nothing. Garfield Bulldogs as uh, the and there's a handoff going around right in oh look out this could go for 90 yards oh it's right down at the 37 yard line Flores takes a snap there's a the pitch Aguilar cutting turning spinning still on his feet he's breaking it he's at the 50 30 Again, jumps over one defender, still on his feet, breaks a tackle, still going down. Oh, he's gonna go all the way. Oh my goodness. Touchdown, Steven Torres. No flags on the field. Diaz takes a snap, finds a man over the middle. That's Laura. And there, you know, check that Laura's in pursuit to the left. Look out for the Hail Mary, there it comes. He's gonna throw it up and it'll be intercepted at the one yard line. And then Giovanni Flores, number three, who will take the snap. And you know, oh, nice leap. Oh, out of the backfield is Aguilar, he's still going. All the way down to the 15 yard line. Fourth and goal from the three yard line. Giovanni Flores, Here we are, it's a post game, and Giovanni Flores, game well, well in hand. You guys took care of business right from right from the start. Yes, we did. We were a wild coach, a wild coach. Coaches taught us what to do. They told us to win, and that's what we did. We came out and win. I want to congratulate Roosevelt on a good game. It should have never been that close, but I want to congratulate them. And I want to dedicate this one to my mama. Happy birthday, mom. I love you. I love you. This is a big win for the Bulldogs this year. You guys are on fire. Yes, we are. Um, I don't want to get out conceited, but we just got to keep doing what we're doing and doing what our coaches teach us. And that's to victory. Get that victory. Get that victory. You have led this team here 8-1 and one now as you go into the final part of the season and then hopefully deep into the playoffs. Deep into the playoffs. We, we weren't even focused on this game. We want a championship ring. That's what we want. We want a ring. Let's talk about your running backs. You guys looking exceptionally well. Flores, Torres, 
Woo! You guys run. Aguilar, both, all, all the running backs are sensational. Sensational. But they couldn't do it without the O-line. The O-line. I'm going to give everything to the O-line. Everything. Absolutely. They were following Mercado. They're following Aguilar on the left side. It was wide open. Yep, wide open. They just keep doing what they're doing. But the whole line deserves it. And you showed your versatility. And David Lara, you guys hooked up on a huge yes, play. Did. That big bomb dropped in there. We got we got threats everywhere. We got pass, run. Our defense is off the hook. That's my baby right here. I represent him. There it is. That's Rudy. 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 Rudy Mercado, you open up all those lines. Yep. All, all those holes for the back. Yep, yep. I'm, 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 glad, I'm glad of you. You got a running back right here. Bring him in here. And I'll right here. The team was on fire tonight. You guys were hitting on all cylinders. The execution was right on time. Giovanni said the coaches prepared you guys well. Yeah, they did. I mean, we just had to come out. It was like a regular game. We had to focus. I mean, practice hard. And sure enough, we had to. We came out. The only thing that was different was the fans, and they supported us, and we came out with that victory. I mean, it was a good feeling. The fans, the fans had a big part to do with it. And, and we hope they keep supporting us through our championship. Thank you. Thank you. What's next? What's, what's next right now for the Bulldogs? Where are you guys headed now? What's the next game? Southeast is next, and then after that's playoffs, and we're looking for that championship. I want that ring, baby. All right, Bulldogs number one. The opponents tonight, you, you had them right from the start, first play of the game, and yep. you guys were off to the race. I mean, the whole line, the whole line made those holes. Everybody got it. The receivers made the block, the good fakes. Everybody bit. We had a good opportunity right there. Good. Everybody had a chance to get in there and play and do well. Okay. And I give a lot of shout out to all the O line. The O line, we work hard for these guys. The O line, the O line. We just keep it in my mouth. And the offense couldn't do as well as they do without the defense. We have a great defense. Don't forget about that. We have a great That's defense. That's what I'm saying. Our defense is good. Okay. I, I, I want to say I love you guys all. Oh, oh. And I love you too. I love you too. Okay, where's Aguilar? Is he around still? <laughs> Let's see if we can find him. If you can send him over here, we want to talk to Aguilar as well. Okay? Wait, come here, baby. I want to hold him real quick. Bring him over here. Okay? A lot of credit to the coaches, you know, because the coaches time is putting effort into teaching us what we know, you know, from the from the bottom. So all the coaches, give a shout out to all the coaches, you know, they work really hard. All the weekends, they stay up late, you know, making all the game plans and stuff, and so a shout out to the coaches. What was it like this weekend prepare for Roosevelt? Oh, it was big, you know. They they stayed up late every, from after the game on Friday, morning, morning today, morning, morning today. today. Morning they were just preparing our game. And we want to show up the yeah, hard this work. This is the hard, hard work. work. Hard 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 work pays off. Hard work pays off. And he's just gonna stay at Marco, baby. It belongs here. It belongs here. Oh, Giovanni. Giovanni, you're the leader of this team. How close is this team? Are you guys beyond brothers? We're beyond brothers. We're, we're family. That's all we can say is family. We're, we're blood. We're blood. Okay. And so it's all right. We all want the We all want the same dream. One family. One team. One dream. We're family. There you go. One team. One dream. We, not me, as they say, right? And that dream is a championship. We want that ring. That's the championship ring, baby. Yeah, yeah. What will the coaches do now with the team? Will it be like a little celebration? You guys go back to camp? Celebrate, but we didn't celebrate. But Saturday morning, right back to work. This is us here, baby. We want a championship. That's what we want. That's what we want. All right. Good job. You guys haven't been introduced. Come on in. What's your name? I'm Samuel Leah. I'm 57. I'm part of the Down and Dirty D line. Okay, the D line. Hey, piss a shot off for nearly the whole. Yeah, there we go. Okay. Yeah. D line, where are they? Where are those D line guys? Right here. Yeah, right here. Yeah, here. The smallest cat. Hey. Star baby, I'll fight six. Number 79. He's ready for the whole keeper. D line, we're on 69. Yeah, baby. My name yeah. is Ron. Record AK, Turtle Baby. Now with the big back D line, baby. Yeah. Yeah. Give yeah, the props to the D line. <laughs> Okay, we're still trying to do a few more pickups here. Find Aguilar if you could for me. Is he around? Giovanni, find Michael Aguilar for me. Okay, if you can. If he's open, send him over here for me, would you? Bring him back and talk to you guys. Okay, here we are now, right in the field at Weingar Stadium. Garfield Bulldogs taking care of business tonight. Rowdy in the Roosevelt Rough Riders. Really no contest. Final score shows 35-13, but hey, it was not that close until the last when Roosevelt got up on the board. But again, a very well played game. Coach Hernandez doing his thing to prepare the players. O-line, D-line, running backs, air game, you name it. Tight ends, the entire package right here. Don't forget special teams. And of course, special teams. Okay, uh, we're going to make the rounds here, try to get as many guys of players up on camera as we can. Uh, we still need to speak to number 31. If we can find him, we want to talk to Aguilar, okay? All right? 
Give us your names again, son. All right, my name is Adrian Longoria. This is David Lopez right here. We've been playing. Okay. Starting middle linebacker. Okay. Uh, D tackle. Okay. Defensive okay. tackle, Aaron, Aaron Lopez. Okay. And how, how important is this in you guys as high school players to play in a game like this with so many fans? It's very important. You know, it's a big tra tradition. You know, we come out here and we just, we pay for the fans. Yeah. You know, they, they come out, they pay money to come watch us play. So our job is just to put on a performance. And, and that's what we do. It's tradition. There's a lot of tradition in this. And the coaches keep you guys focused, right? Yeah. That's right, sir. And it's 31 for you, sir. 31. Okay, here he is, Michael Aguilar. How you doing tonight, Michael? I'm doing great, sir. Big, big game, huge. The old line just opened the door for you. You just walked right through it. Three touchdowns, and your skills were basically on display for the entire fans. Fans who came out to see you. Your thoughts and your comments on this game tonight? Well, it was it was a well played game. We like we had a good week of practice. Our old lines, the, they're the ones that put in the whole work, the whole week. Our coach told us that it was going to be based on them how we perform and. They showed on the field. They, they Tremendous article in the LA Times uh, a couple over last week and, and that had to get, keep you focused on what you're doing, of course, and it pointed out the fact that, hey, even though you have maybe the, the eye is, is not 100%, it doesn't matter. You will do what you have to do. Yeah, that's right. And your family? My family, family. oh yeah, they support me. Okay. I give it out to them and the stand's still right there. Okay, all right. Go back to, to campus, maybe get some rest tomorrow, tonight and tomorrow, and then you're back on the practice field. Back right? to work. Okay. Get the weight. One more team and then the playoffs. Yes. Okay. Hopefully the championship. All right. Hey, a team effort, and uh, it's, a, it's a, I think Giovanni said it's a the team effort all the way, and uh, the coaches also have to share in the glory tonight. Yeah, they do. Okay. Good luck to you, son. Thank okay, you. keep up the good work. All right. We'll try to get a, a, a spot here if we can with Coach Hernandez and close out here our presentation of East LA Sports Scene as we cover the classic November the 3rd, 2006. We'll be right back with the conclusion.